Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So, late on Friday last week in my part of the world, we received a brand new Insider Preview build for the Beta Channel Insiders, build 22635.4800. And just to focus on two new features that rolled out um, in this latest Beta Channel release. And the first one is the top cards under settings, which we have spoken about previously when it was very much a hidden feature in preview and has now made its way into official testing. And because it's in beta now, although not confirmed, I would say there's quite a good chance that this will eventually roll out to the stable version of Windows 11 in an up and coming update. Now, just a quick recap, if you missed my previous videos, um, Microsoft say that it's rolling out top cards under settings system about, as we can see. And they mentioned that these top cards provide an easy way to view your PC's key specifications, like your processor, your RAM, your GPU storage, and so on. And it helps you to understand your PC's capabilities at a glance, according to Microsoft. And they say that this is designed to simplify decision making by highlighting potential areas for hardware improvements while giving you a clear snapshot of your PC. And they've also mentioned that top cards won't appear yet on managed commercial PCs. And what we are looking at here, obviously, is the new top cards at the top of the About Settings page displaying your PCs, processor, RAM, storage, and GPU specifications. And just to give us a kind of a wider perspective, here's a um, screen grab that I used in a previous video where you can put it more in relation on the settings system about page. So there we go. Now currently in the stable version, the top of the page is here where you've got to rename this PC. So that's as the name implies are top cards. And I actually think that this is a nice move in the right direction because it just gives you a quick overview as to your PC specifications and is very handy if, as an example if you need to check out your storage or replace um, your GPU or RAM and so on. So um, I think that's a nice move in the right direction. And then just something else I want to mention for this video, there are a couple of minor improvements and fixes in the beta channel, nothing really worth talking about. But um, Microsoft has also mentioned that they are starting to roll out the settings homepage for commercial customers on PCs that are managed by an IT administrator. So the feature will show some existing cards relevant to enterprise managed PCs like recommended settings and Bluetooth devices, as well as two new enterprise specific device info and accessibility preference cards. And also mentioned that for commercial customers who, who also use their Microsoft account on their managed PC, there will also be a new accounts card indicating the presence of both work and school and Microsoft account types. So. Um, obviously, this won't be affecting your average home user, but I thought it was relevant um, and just thought I'd use this image just to give you a general idea. But as mentioned, the top cards system about, I think that would be the so-called highlight for last week's beta channel build. And there's a very good chance I would suggest that that will make its way to the stable version sooner than later. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.